you guys want to fly into Trill City RP V2, make sure that you guys click the link in the first description or the link in the comment section. The white listing is free. I repeat, white listing is free in Trill City RP. If you want to get a priority application done, that is a paid fee, but the actual white listing applications get checked on the daily basis and they get approved in the manner that they were given. All right. King Kong, King Kong, King Kong, Abba, King Kong. How you doing? Welcome back to orientation. Today we're going to be talking about pricing. Pricing is something that we really, really love to take advantage of here at LSC simply because it makes sense for our workers to make money while working. Yeah, that paycheck is great and all, but we'd love for you guys to make the extra cash in your pocket to make sure that you can go ahead and do what you need to do off the clock. So now that we have the menu open, let's talk about prices for a moment. You guys may notice the price sheet on the right side of the screen. Those are the prices that we charge our customers. But don't forget, we also get charged here at LSC for the work that we do. Now, let me explain a little bit better. When working on someone's car, you, the employee, do not get charged. I, as the CEO in the society account, gets charged for when you do the work. So I'll tell you guys about billing a little bit later in the video, but for right now, I just want to tell you guys the prices and how we work those out. So working on a car, it can get pretty expensive. The most that someone has paid working on a car for me has been over $175,000. And the reason for that is that they got every upgrade, everything that you see on that price sheet. Now, for the engine upgrades, remember I told you that they charge the society account for the work? If you notice, an engine upgrade costs $20,000. We charge people $25,000 for the work, which means there's only a really a $5,000 profit from the actual job. But you as the employee, if you use the billing app, you'll get 10% commission off that per, uh, that purchase all right now let's go ahead and that means brakes that means transmission that means suspension that means armor yes armor now armor is a little different we charge fifty thousand dollars here for armor because we as lsc employees and management and owner want to make sure that the person that's upgrading the armor is getting all the commission that they need from that hard work so 10% of 50,000 is pretty pretty good just saying now as far as turbo goes turbo is one of those things where if a customer comes in for a repair or a paint or anything like that something small not too not too uh enhanced or difficult you want to make sure you charge them the amount that it costs for turbo but make sure you have them cash app you and if you guys don't know what Cash App means, Cash App is your tag when you type in slash ID. For Apple Pay, that's through the banking app. We don't usually do Apple Pay here, but we can do Apple Pay if a customer only has that and doesn't have the cash in their pocket, all right? So when doing Turbo, make sure you get your 10,000. If you use the billing app for the 10,000 on the Turbo, all I'm saying is don't come to me talking about, I charge it to the billing app and I need my money. <laughs> you, you asked out <laughs> now as far as horns horns is something that doesn't cost anything resprays are completely different i need to break this down to you as an employee when respraying a car if you notice on a price sheet it costs fifteen hundred dollars for paint that's not to paint the whole car that's only for one category so let me tell you what I mean. For primary paint, it costs $800 in the society billing to me as the CEO, which means you charge the customer $1,500 because remember, you have to make something from your commission or if you get it charged to your pockets, okay? So when you charge somebody $1,500, you're charging them $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500, $1,500,
they're looking at a nine thousand dollar job for paint alone if they upgrade the dashboard the interior the wheels pearlescent secondary and primary they're looking at a whopping nine thousand dollar bill so make sure that you take that into account when doing paint and also remember when you're doing paint you want to scroll through the paints don't enter on any of the paints or we will be charged for that paint so if a customer is looking at paints and they're like they're undecided keep on scrolling do not hit enter and verify that paint color until they decide that's what they want window tint you guys see the price sheet this is how much it costs us for tint but we charge people by the visibility okay make sure that you guys get your money neons neons don't cost anything which means <laughs> That money that you get for the lights is free. Exxon headlights, same thing. Doesn't cost anything. So make sure you get that money towards your pockets. That means ask for the cash app or you can do Apple Pay. Wheels are a little different. Wheels don't cost anything, even though we charge for wheels, but it's the paint that we'd like to charge for. Also, custom tires. For custom tires, it'll cost them, but it won't cost you. So make sure that you get your cash app or your Apple Pay, all right? now the next thing liveries some of them are on some cars that's a totally different subject we usually do liveries such as paint so if we would do a whole library wrap it'll be double what paint costs which means three thousand dollars plate index if you guys notice to do plates it costs two thousand dollars it costs us one thousand but it'll only cost them two thousand all right now vehicle extras that's all up to what the vehicle is you can do these custom uh things for up to i would say five thousand per custom all right and what i mean by that is some of these things click on and off if you notice a roll cage just popped in that's a five thousand dollar roll cage right there you know what i'm saying if they want a front license plate you, you see that front license plate <laughs> you're gonna have to pay that all right you're gonna have to pay that tab if you want that now, let me go ahead and show you guys how to build a customer, right? Now, the first thing you want to do is ask the customer for their cash app. Once they give you their cash app, which is slash ID, you can go ahead and do slash billing. You will want to do their ID in the amount that it costs for the job. Once you hit enter, they, in fact, will pull out their phone because they'll get a notification for a bill and they'll go to the billing app and pay the bill right then and there. Once they pay the bill, you get 10% commission and then they go ahead and pay that money to society so you can keep working on cars throughout the day and they can go ahead and store their car over at one of the parking spots and then pull it back out and make sure all the changes and all the upgrades have stuck. I wanna thank you for watching this video. Make sure if you enjoy, like, share, and subscribe. The next orientation that we will be going over is how to interact with people via social media and yellow pages. That means how to post our flyers, how to interact with people via Twitter and what you need to say to get customers to, you know, give up a little bit more of that cash. See you guys in the next video.